Yeah, I'd rather be a lover than a fighter Cause all my life I've been fighting Never felt a feeling of comfort Hey guys, how are you today? So, I'm just gonna make a really short video Um, next week I It's my last week of, um College this year And I'm finishing up um, next week with finals and stuff like that so it won't be too much longer till I am um, back on track with my videos and be able to um, better communicate with you all but I did want to show you just a few things here uh, that I feel like you would like to see and that you will enjoy so the first thing as you can tell is this orchid that is right in front of you this is a Sarcochylus orchid, and this is purchased from SVO, I I forget, a few years ago now. And um, there are the names of the parents, but this is such a beautiful little delicate flower. I love it. Um, it happens to be pink. It seems like, for some reason, somebody pointed out to me that most of my orchids have some sort of pink to them which I think is um, funny because I, that's not my favorite color. Pink is definitely not my favorite color but um, it is apparently in my orchids for sure. But what a beautiful little thing. Um, it has a lot of spikes on it. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven spikes on this. Uh, it never bloomed before, so I think that's um, somewhat of a reason why it has so many spikes. What? Very beautiful, and I love the uh, pattern on it. The next thing, uh, when I went to go see Dr. Moats speak, I bought this miniature Vanda, Vanda Moats Golden Imp. And it's a cross between Vanda Cristata by Testacea. And here is its flower. A very cute. Uh, orange, yellow background with the sepal and petals. And then a very bright um, fuchsia purple lip. Which is, uh, it's more of a dark purple on camera, but it is a bit like a, a fuchsia color in person. Very cute. Uh, as you can tell, they bloom on very small plants. There's my hand. And there is the plant. So, definitely, if you're looking for miniature Vandas, Moats is the place to go. Very nice. Now, the last thing I want to show you is this um, Paphiopedium that I bought last year that you all saw. There's the name. It's a little unsteady because I need to stake the flower, but here it is. Very dark, very beautiful. Um, yeah, it's very nice. But that's all I have for you. I hope you enjoyed this video, and definitely I will be back very soon with my regular videos, and we will have lots of fun. All right, guys, I will talk to you later. Bye.